All right, my friend, welcome. My name is Dr. Anthony Balduzzi. I'm the founder here at the Fit Father Project. I'm with my head trainer, Stuart Carter, and we're gonna show you the proper way to do body weight single leg lunges, which is one of the best body weight exercises you can do, uh, not just for leg strength, which it definitely will help, but also for burning fat and just really getting a great cardio workout with just using your body and around five feet of floor space. So in this video, we're gonna cover the essential form tips that you must follow, how to do this properly, safely, to get the maximum benefit. I know you're gonna love it. Let's dive on in. FitFatherProject.com. All right, so to start talking about how to do the bodyweight lunge, before we even talk about taking our first step, if you will, we gotta talk about the posture and the setup with the body. So Stuart is standing roughly shoulder width apart, and he has a nice upright posture. His ankle is in, in line with his knee, which is in line with his hip, which is in line with his shoulder and his head. If we start in bad position in any of these exercises, and you hear me harp on this all the time in our tutorials, ultimately he's gonna carry that bad position into the motion. So we need to make sure he's got a good posture, Stuart's engaging his core, and now one leg at a time, Stuart is gonna take a step forward into a lunge position, boom, he steps out, he's coming down, pausing, and driving right back up to starting position. He's gonna to continue to do a couple reps and I'm gonna talk about some key form points. First, notice Stuart's alternating legs. That's why this makes an alternating lunge. He has his arms out behind his sides for balance. And this is an important point because these lunges are not just like a, you know, a muscularly taxing exercise. It requires balance and his entire core has to stabilize himself as he's going down doing these lunges. So a little bit of a pro tip is that when you're taking a step, the wider you step out, if you give yourself a little wider base, you can get a little better balance. Now, also notice at the bottom, pause here for a second. Stuart is in position where you can see his knee is not tracking too far over his toe. This is a good position. Now, Stuart's gonna fire back through his heel, right back up to starting position. Now, Stuart, I want you to show him a bad lunge. What happens if you're not maintaining this upright position and what happens if you're not uh, getting that knee in the proper position here? Show him what a bad rep looks like. Stepping forward, tracking over. You see almost Stuart almost fell over doing that? What's happening in this position, and do a couple more bad reps. Stuart's whole body is tracking over his knee. He's almost like falling over. He's almost falling over and he's allowing his whole upper body to collapse over his leg. Not good. What we want to do is maintain a strong upright spine so Stuart stays upright and he's firing right on back. A couple other things. As you're doing this lunge, Stuart, when he plants his foot, is driving through his heel on the way back. The more explosively you drive from that front leg and that front glute, uh, the better results you're gonna get from this exercise. If you explode on back, that engages some of the fast switch muscle fibers in your legs that'll ultimately produce a better metabolic effect, a better strength training effect, so that's really important. And as you can see, this is, a, this is an exercise that I recommend you do for time. You have a, a stopwatch here. I would set a stopwatch and I would have Stuart try to do as many of these as he could do in about one minute, which he's clearly done at this point. He's doing a great job demoing these for us, so thank you, Stuart, we appreciate you. Um, but yeah, that is how you do a single leg uh, dumbbell lunge. There's a more advanced variation. You can definitely hold dumbbells at your sides and do this as well, but just to start out, Doing this is really great for most guys, and this is one of those core exercises you can do. You do not need a big gym to be able to get a great workout. So this, along with some of our other body weight exercise tutorial videos that are linked here right now, um, is just a great way to really just incorporate this stuff into your training. And if you're looking to burn fat, to increase your metabolism, to build some muscle, and you're a busy father in your 40s, 50s, and 60s, then we're your guys. We have a free 24 minute fat burning workout that's linked above here in the video that uh, goes through the best exercises that you can do in a five flow sequence in just 24 minutes, five feet of floor space. And if you wanna get access to that free workout video, just click the link above, take you to the very next page, and Stuart and I will email you that workout, and then we're gonna take you through everything step by step. I know you're gonna absolutely love that. So if you like this video, I also wanna invite you to subscribe to our Fit for Our Project YouTube channel. We're posting great tutorials just like this every single week where Stuart's demoing things, I'm ranting like I normally do, um, so you'll get used to that and I hope you enjoy uh, all the stuff we're putting out here at the Fit Follower Project. Uh, click also the other links, you can see some more other videos. Thank you for being here, welcome to the Fit Follower Project. We'll see you soon in our other videos, take care.